Okay, recording started. Great. Um, so guys, uh, you all know that Giant Accounts Limited, uh, and if you don't know, I'll tell you. So Giant Accounts Limited, um, it's a part of Giant Group. Uh, my name is Shivani Sharma. I'm the manager of uh, Giant Accounts Limited. And uh, we have been in this business for many years. I started working at Giant uh, around five and a half years ago. Um, so under Giant Accounts Limited, uh, we provide a lot of services to a lot of companies. Uh, we have a lot of clients. The services that we provide, um, it includes, I'll, I'll jump onto the th uh, page number three. So it includes all these services. So we incorporate the limited companies. We register them for VAT, for payroll, for corporation tax, for self-assessment. We do their VAT returns, quarterly or monthly VAT returns. We do their payrolls. We do their annual accounts. Um, we file the accounts with HMRC. We file the business tax return with HMRC. We file the accounts with, um, uh, with the company's house. We do all the company secretarial work. And uh, we also do the bookkeeping and the management accounts. So uh, we have around, um, 800 uh, clients at the moment. Uh, most of them, they are small, small limited companies, but we are now moving on to the, the bigger companies uh, that are not small, they are medium-sized uh, companies. So um, we, have, uh, we, expect, we have the expertise in uh, dealing with agency clients. Um, so we work with Giant Finance Plus um, and uh, the services that we provide, again, we, we, we do everything for them. Um, uh, the, the, the main thing is the bookkeeping because GF Plus is also part of uh, Giant Accounts, uh, Giant Group, sorry. So with client's permission, um, we can get all the data from them directly. So client doesn't have to uh, get involved in, in the bookkeeping stuff. We get the invoicing, we get the um, uh, purchases and bills and everything from them directly. We do the bookkeeping on behalf of the client. So client really doesn't have to do anything. We, we do take care of everything. That includes, uh, like I said, bookkeeping, the VAT returns, the, uh, the payroll, the, the annual accounts, everything. You name it, we provide that service. Also, we do the uh, the personal tax return. Uh, so every every year, uh, the the clients, the directors of a the company, they they are required to file a personal tax return. We provide that service too, not just to the directors of the company, but for their internal staff um, uh, and their contractors. So we do provide that service too, and we also do the management accounts uh, for them on monthly basis, which means uh, they don't have to wait for uh, a year to get their financial data every month we provide them uh, the management accounts their profit and loss account how they are doing if uh, there's anything that they can do to improve their services where they are where they are with their um, tax liabilities uh, or anything with their filing are they behind on something so we just keep them up to date every year so every month uh, we, and like i said they really don't need to do anything apart from uh, making the bank payments that's the one thing that we don't do for them we don't make the payments on their behalf for example um, we'll prepare and file their vat return but we won't make the payment we'll just uh, let them know uh, that you need to make the payment so other than this uh, making the payments to uh, to hmrc we do everything for them uh, and also if uh, they want us to deal with uh, hmrc on their behalf to speak to hmrc on their behalf if there's any problem or any issue we we do that as well so basically uh, everything all the accountancy bookkeeping and tech services we provide all those services to them and uh, yeah and our our rates are not i mean the the, the charges uh, it all depends on the on their turnover so if their turnover is not that big it's a small turnover our charges would be uh, would be accordingly will be it will be less charges uh, for that service so, I mean, the, yeah, go on, sure. Um, can they build that service as they need it? So they might, obviously there's a lot that we do there, but can they build it, you know, with some of those parts of, of the, the service we can provide and then how will that affect the cost as well? Yes, uh, so yes. So for example, if a client does, only, doesn't uh, want us, uh, doesn't want to buy the, the whole package, they just want us to do their, let's say for example, just the VAT returns, quarterly VAT returns, then they can contact us every three months and we'll do that for them. Or they just need us for their monthly uh, staff uh, payroll. 
uh, or they can contact us just uh, once in a year for their person tax return for their annual accounts filing. So yes, we can provide that service too. In that case, there won't be a monthly charge. There'll be just a, a one-off charge, but and we can provide that. Uh, we, we can provide you a quote according. I mean, based on uh, the uh, information that you need uh, or the services that you uh, require, we can provide you a quote for one-off services as well. Yes. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. So uh, the reason for this uh, presentation was, guys, so that when you are talking to your clients, uh, potential clients next, so maybe you can, you can, you'll be more confident about our services. You know that these are the services that we offer, and you can confidently talk to your potential clients about these services. Shivani, I'm just mm -hmm. thinking it might be useful as well if you could just outline for the guys, if you just talk us through an example. So if you pick one of the clients, mm -hmm. talk us through um the nature of their business what you did on your sort of you know what the process was for you speaking to them and then getting them set up and then what the pricing looked like based on the size of that business so just to give just outline a, an example as a bit of a case study might help okay i'll just um i won't i can't uh, i mean there's some information that i won't be able to share but uh for example uh we have uh, age, uh the agency clients uh uh, sorry, Jen, I don't have those screens ready uh, with me, but I'll just, uh, just, just uh, talk. talk. The detail. Yeah. Pick, yeah. pick one of the clients and just so, overview. So, yeah, our biggest client that we have, uh, their turnover is between um, uh, five to uh, five to eight million. Uh, so, that's, that's an agency client, and uh, like I said, GF Plus, uh, they do their payroll, payroll for their contractors. Uh, so, and we do the accounting part. Um, so, anything uh, GF Plus will uh, raise the invoices, collect the money uh, on behalf of uh, the client from the uh, from the uh, third party, uh, and also they'll run the payroll for the contractors, and we get all the data from them. And um, then we just uh, uh, we just process the data into our system. We have an accountancy software. It's a it's a cloud based software. So everything uh, on our end is very easy. Uh, a cloud based software that we use, uh, and client can access that software too. We can access that software too. Um, so what our clients, uh, what they do every month, uh, we, we, first of all, we get the information from GF Plus on, um, on fortnightly basis. We update everything on our software, which is called Free Agent. Um, it's an accountancy cloud-based software. And we keep their books up to date. And every month, a client, when they want to withdraw some money from the company, they contact us that, OK, well, I want to withdraw this much from the company. Uh, can I do that? What are the tax implications? Then the accountant, every all the clients will be assigned uh, an independent uh, independent accountant. So they, uh, whenever they have any question, they can email that person directly, that accountant directly. And they also uh, are given a, a direct contact number, and we do have quarterly Zoom meetings with our client just to understand uh, what they uh, want us to do uh, if they have any uh, further requirements. So um, every month, they every month or every quarter, they contact us. Uh, they discuss their profit. We do give, like I said, we do give them their management account, so they don't they will not have many questions because everything is there in their in those management accounts. Um, uh, they have their profits. Uh, how much profit uh, is what profit is available, what would be the personal tax on that profit, uh, how much money do they need to keep aside for their future um, liabilities, how much money do they keep? Uh, do, do they need to keep aside for business tax liabilities. So uh, we just need to make sure that they don't run out of the money uh, at any time. They have enough money uh, uh, kept aside for their business liability and they have enough money for their uh, profits as well. We, we also make sure that they don't uh, overdraw uh, their business account because some of them, we have few clients who when when they came to us, they their accounts were in very bad shape. Like um, they, they had overdrawn like a lot of money from their company, which they now have to uh, repay, but they don't have the money to repay. I mean, we didn't generate any money for them. I mean, they were doing their own business. Yeah, what, go was, on. What, was, what was the name of the client in your example? What's the name of the agency? Okay, uh, the name of the agency was uh, Bespoke Recruitment. Okay, so when when you spoke to Bespoke, what mm -hmm. steps? You know, if the guys need to provide you with a lead, 
mm -hmm. they find another agency like Bespoke, what information would you like my sales guys to provide to you so that you can have that initial call with them? So the services that we, uh, so, so the, uh, the documents or the information that we may need uh, from you is, of course, first the, the, the company name. Uh, we can then uh, find all the information on company's house, when was the last year in accounts file or uh, uh, things like that. And uh, we also need to know if they want us to start work, if they want us as their accountant, do they want us to start working on their accounts from today, or they want uh, uh, the services uh, for the prior period as well, then we'll, of course there will be an additional charge for that uh, service. So basically we just need their uh, last filed accounts their uh, last filed bat accounts um, and the trial balance the up-to-date trial balance that's that's all we need uh, uh, in the beginning mm -hmm. and, and, and you'd, all, want, you'd want them to probably outline the reasons why they're not happy with their existing account for example yes and i'm more than happy to um, i'm more than happy to speak to your client i mean they don't have to buy our services i can just uh, uh, introduce uh, myself and I, I can offer the services that don't have to buy it. They can just uh, see what we offer. And, and so far, in terms of the referrals that you've had, I know you've mm -hmm. got a pretty good strike rate of the inquiries over versus converting them and becoming clients. Can you give mm -hmm. the guys an idea of how many businesses have been introduced to and how many we've converted? Uh, so we have uh, at the moment we have uh, we, we only started this uh, this thing uh, like very recently not a long time ago so at the moment we have uh, five big clients and we have uh, eight clients that will be converted I mean who have who are happy to uh, join us and very soon we are in the process at the moment the process is that we are dealing with their uh, existing accountant um, we need to get all the information from their existing account and we are in that process at the moment so um, the target is to get at least 40 clients by the end of uh, the next financial year by end of 31st of may but uh, Wait, sorry what was the time? 40, uh, 40, 40. 40. Okay. So, uh, but we, uh, by the end of December, we should have uh, at least 13 clients, uh, uh, 13 big clients. Uh, and in the example of bespoke that you mentioned before, five to eight million turnover, what's the annual accountancy fee that you're charging them? The annual accountancy fee uh, is... Roughly, we don't need the actual specific... No, I'll just give you um, roughly... Um, is it done on a, a percentage or is it a one-off charge? It's a it's a monthly uh, fee, right? Yeah, it's based on the turnover, and it's, um, it's a monthly fee. So, and also uh, one thing, I I'll tell you the fee just now. Uh, if they ha if uh, the agencies or any these clients, if they hire us, they don't need to pay their, uh, pay their uh, internal bookkeeper, because the internal bookkeeper does all the bookkeeping, uh, the ledgers, and this staff they don't need to uh, hire a bookkeeper because we will be uh, taking care of that as well so before they came to us they were paying a lot of money um, so they were paying around 26000 uh, in in accountancy and bookkeeping altogether we spoke uh, a lot of money so uh, we have uh, we have around the, the fee that they pay us is uh, 11 between 11 to 12000 a year yeah and that is for a big turnover client. Uh, if we have small turnover clients as well, for example, whose turnover is around 250K uh, a year or uh, maybe less than that. So our, our fee will be around 2,500 a year or 3,000 uh, five between that 2,500 and 3,500 a year. Okay. Uh, again, so that includes the, all the bookkeeping. Yeah, so they're the important numbers for my guys to get interested because what, what they get paid for from a community uh, commission perspective is generating revenue for the group mm -hmm. so the headline there guys is if you any gf plus client that we've got it's a very easy sell to be selling in shivani to do an introduction mm -hmm. and we can dramatically save them money on their existing arrangement and it's just a quick and easy upsell so in bespoke's a large agency but that's an additional 12 grand a contribution coming through mm -hmm. onto your uh, against your target it makes it a pretty obvious upsell for us uh, and again you can see the angles there that Shivani would leverage it's costing you x at the moment because you're paying y to your accountant and z to an internal bookkeeper and um, obviously again it's the whole outsourcing thing that we talk about take the heads out of your business outsource it, source it to someone like us because you're a gf plus client we've got all that available data 
at our fingertips. You don't even have to send them the information like we would have to with their existing accountant. Very simple. So pretty ambitious target to get up to 40 agencies, but we're making progress on it quite quickly. Mm -hmm. Any reason, Shivani, would you act as the accountant for, a, for an agency that was a non GF plus client? Um, yeah, I mean, it uh, doesn't matter. I mean, GF plus, of course, it, it makes our life easy, but it does not matter. We, we have uh, the other 800 clients that we have, they are not GF plus clients, and we are, uh, uh, we, are, we are providing the services uh, in a great way. So it doesn't matter if it's a GF plus client or not. Uh, but yeah, it, it makes our life easy if it's a GF plus client. I think but... it would be a good, thank you, Shivani. I think it therefore would be useful, guys. To, I know you've got a lot of strings to your bow and a lot of things in your toolkit, but Shivani's just given you another service there to talk about. So think when you're in your sales calls and you're hitting dead ends and you're going through the various services, we've got accountancy services that we can talk about as well. Um, imagine how many agencies you engage with when you're speaking to them about payroll and what have you you might have been actually considering changing your accountants at that point. Um, I, I'm, it's very rare that you speak to a business who doesn't have a bit of a moan about their accountants and the fees. So there's definitely an opportunity there to open up, especially in this time of year when everyone's looking at costs really closely. Um, I think it's definitely something that you should be able to add into your conversations and it directly will impact your contribution and you'll get commission for it. And uh, one more thing, um, it takes around one month's time to uh, transfer everything, to move everything over from uh, the old account to the new account. So, um, so we do not charge for the first month. The first month would be free of charge. I mean, we start our services from the first day, but we do not charge for first month because it just uh, we are just trying to uh, we just try to uh, bring everything up to date. Uh, so that's another advantage. Um, so yeah, if, and like I said, we do offer uh, one of services as well. It doesn't have to be in a package. We do offer all these services uh, separately as well. Great. Yeah. Thanks, Devani. Have we got any questions from anyone on, on any of those points? Just one from me. Of the 800 clients that aren't with GF Plus, how many of those, do we know how many of those are agencies or if there are any agencies in that? No, they're not agencies. They're not, uh, it's no, just only GF Plus, which agencies? Yes, uh, because uh, yeah, uh, we 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 have recently started this agency uh, accounting thing. I mean, we can, right. and we already have specialization in all these payroll and all these areas. So why not agencies? But no, all the other clients are different, uh, different in, in different businesses. Are all individual? The majority of them are individual, individual PSCs. Contract. Yeah, PSCs. Mm -hmm. Correct. So the angle, yeah. obviously with giant accounts is the fact that, yes, we can offer them accountancy services, but we're also recruitment specialists as well. So again, value add for Shivani, as well as just doing the numbers a lot more efficiently and at a more cost effective price is also the fact we can advise them on all the various areas that we advise on from, you know, payroll, insurance, um, all the, that is not something that normal accountants would be able to help on generally because they're not contractor specialists. Yeah, uh, thanks for reminding that, uh, Dan, uh, Dan, very quickly. So not just these services, uh, we do provide uh, all the initial setup services. For example, we can help you to set up a limited company, the recruitment agency. Then uh, we can help help you open a business bank account, uh, the, the initial business bank account. We can also help you with your, your business insurances as well. Uh, so, and at no additional cost. Super. Any other questions from anyone else before we wrap up? Take that as a no and stop the recording. Okay, great. Uh, so